Okay, so you may or may not have seen my uh, other video on candy canes. Um, but you know, if not, go and have a look. Uh, this is just another method because I did mention that there are other ways of doing candy canes. So this is just a, a quick video on um, how to do the other method. Um, I've just got some free back combed bits of hair, just in sort of purple, black, and sort of maroon. Um, you will need to uh, section off your hair, again half as much as you'd need, and back comb it beforehand. Um, it's a lot of faff and I don't like doing it that way because it kind of looks ropey and I don't know I like the other method because I just think it's more secure, but anyway. So line them up so they're roughly even, these are just two out of my spares pile so I'll have to, they're about the same. And again, secure that to your <laughs> workspace. And this is dead easy. Um, if you if you need to see a video on backcombing, I have two two different methods. Go check them out. Um, okay, this is dead easy. All you need to do is, as you can see, just wrap them around each other. And although this method will give you more even candy canes, um, I still prefer doing it the other way just because for me the benefits outweigh cons. So although my candy canes may not be as even as, as if I was doing it that way, I can get them pretty even. It just takes a lot. It just takes practice, um, and you'll learn to judge it. So. As you can see, I mean, obviously this is thicker than you'd probably do because, well, these are just two that I've pulled out, and then you'd twist the ends and then you'd seal it, so it looks like this. So as you can see, the can the the twist is more even, but less I, I would say less secure but some people like doing it this way and you know that's fine so yeah that was it really quick video um any questions comments or requests as always let me know and i'll do my very best to get back to you or you know make a video